This is the number one, the number one in all of the world and outer space, the number one best fried chicken. And you know how I know this? Because we're at the number one place for fried chicken, the Southern Living Test Kitchen. If they don't know about fried chicken, nobody knows about fried chicken. So this is my guarantee. It's the number one. Thank you so much for being here today. I'm Alex Hitz. I'm at the Temple of Southern Food. This is where it all happens, the number one place, and I'm frying chicken today. I'm so excited to fry Dorothy's fried chicken from my book in this kitchen. This is far out, and I'm glad you're going to be here to watch it with me. Salt and pepper, onions and garlic. Beat the eggs with the milk and pour all of this over the chicken mixture. Yum. The chicken is soaking in the wet stuff and it's time for the dry stuff now. Yum. Flour, salt and pepper, chili powder, paprika. Mmm. Didn't quite get all that. And oregano. Now look at this. I'm now to bread this chicken. The secret to my chicken is it's got this amazing crust. So we're going to put it in there and then we put this on here. We give it a little shake. Yum. And then we dredge it again. This is going to ensure a perfectly gorgeous crust in every way. And here we go back again. because we're going to take it over to that oil, which is magically, through the magic of television, magically heated to 325 degrees. That's what we love right there. Mm. Now, it takes a minute. You cannot rush perfection. It takes a while. Rome was not built in a day, and neither was the most perfect fried chicken on the history of the face of the earth. It was not built in one day. It takes about seven minutes for um, the thinner parts and a little bit more, maybe up to 15, for the breast. But you want to make sure that it's golden and not dark brown. Because if it's dark brown, it's going to be too dry on the inside. You don't want that. Mm. 